context. Many of us um, have the misunderstanding that, or misconception that preparing for the exams is just drill and practice. Yes, to a large, ex to a large extent it is still drill and practice. But parents, you recall, you know, you will, re I think you will be aware that as the children are drilling and practicing, they're beginning to learn how to sustain their energy, they're beginning to learn how to sustain their attention. Those are very, you know, that is a very important trait, right, for good quality work, right? And, you know, the effort you put into preparing an exam, right? Those are, so the exam in itself is, you know, some, it is the context. But the context enables you to develop certain habits of mind which are needed for lifetime success, okay? I think... Um, Many people ask us what's the difference between our school and mainstream schools. If you look at what um, is on the screen there, you notice that the regular subjects are similar. But it is the way in which we present it. So in lower sec, instead of doing science per se, we do applied science. So same scientific foundation, all right, but we give it an applied twist. What's different is that you notice in lower sec, um, most schools will have uh, art lessons where they learn how to sketch and draw and all that. We don't have art lessons. We have something that is uh, more um, 21st century, if, uh, for want of a better word. We have this subject called Art, Design, Media and Technology. Okay, so the students uh, learn design using you know, computer software. They learn architecture, some principles of product design. Okay? They use some pretty cool um, software. We even have uh, 3D modeling, okay, which is quite interesting as well. For me, at least, I'm a humanities trained person. I find that very interesting. We also have this subject called innovation and entrepreneurship. Okay, um, again, we it is not that we want to um, nurture businessmen. What we want to do is to nurture that eye for opportunities, that eye for problem solving, creative problem solving, all right? And we do pro provide them with the protocols to do that. And of course, they do learn some basic um, things about marketing and what firms do, all right, to market their products, okay? Um, in upper secondary, the students prepare for O-levels, right? Um, they, they adhere to the O-levels, um, Syllabus, they all do pure sciences. We do not have combined sciences because we're School of Science and Technology and we have ABLE students. Um, what you notice is number six. Can you see number six? The applied subjects, biotechnology, design studies, media studies in English, fundamentals of electronics. SST offers this. This is conducted by Nian Poly. And it is taken at an O-level um, standard. Okay, except that the approach is different. Part of the component that is tested is practical. So the biotech students actually have to design a, a, a research project and you know that, that portfolio of theirs, that, that the whole entire um, design and experimental process becomes that portfolio and it is part of the assessment for all levels. That's the difference, okay? Um, so the students here do all do eight subjects. Okay, because they are able students. 